Let's go back to Colorado news. News out of Boulder, where it's colder. You already know what it is. We got nothing to do with this. Appreciate that, Uncle Ocho, for kicking it to your boy once again. All right. Dylan Edwards is on the track. Or should I say back on the track? Once again, working on that speed of his as if he can get any faster. You got the, the speed throughout of the backfield. Fast Dylan Edwards. And I'll share this with you guys on screen as he is competing in track and field now. And I'm sure if you guys are following along with Coach Prime and everything that's going on with the Buffs, you've seen this and you know that Dylan is on that track. I'm going to get to y'all comments in a minute. Make sure you uh, uh, leave them right now, and I'll make sure I read all the comments and definitely read the super chats that come true. All right, here we go. Dylan Edwards, Deion Sanders cheers for two-sport athlete Dennis, Dylan Edwards' first track meet with the Colorado Buffaloes. Dylan is not your average college athlete, of course not. Colorado Buffaloes running back had a stellar freshman season in 2023, becoming the first player in school history to, to record more than 250 rushing yards and receiving in the same year. But that's not all. He was a two-sport standout in high school, excelling in both football and track. The former Kansas Gatorade Player of the Year was the winner of the Under Armour <laughs> Under Armour All-American. I'm thinking about Ocho. I'm sorry about that. But Under Armour All-American game, fastest man competition in 2022. Clocking a 40-yard dash time of 4.4, uh, 4.41 seconds. He was uh, he excelled over some of the top athletes in the nation, including Nicholas Harbor. Yeah, I wish Nick could have came. He went to South Carolina. I thought he was going to Colorado. Nicholas Harbor, and now he's here to make his head coach, Deion Sanders, proud with his recent track venture as he made it um, this past week. As we'll see a couple clips right here from when he took off. Colorado Buffaloes, Dylan Edwards, uh, whose name is synonymous with speed, just made a name for himself at his very first track race. While everybody is happy for him, None can match the pride that Coach Prime Deion Sanders has for his rising star as he attends the track event to show his support and the young freshman didn't let him down, all right? And show you how it, how it ended up. Here we go. The boy fast motion now. Boy fast motion now. Run till it run. What dude from Colorado State came out of nowhere? A lot of people was trying to clown on this, but y'all know, listen, man, football speed, track speed, is speed, speed is speed, but, you know, he coming straight off that football field, straight out of lifting weights. This kid, he'll been running track. That's all he been doing is running track, you know? And, yes, there are fast white guys out there. Trust me, I got beat by one one time. <laughs> Shout out to my dog, Jordan Irvin. All right? But Dylan, he's going to continue to get faster. Uh, this is only going to help his speed on the football field, his conditioning, and everything of that nature. Uh, I wish I would have ran track in high school like my coach was telling me to. Shout out to Ben Obamano who did, and it really paid off for him. Um, but track, if if you have one out there, man, you have an uh, opportunity to run, run track, dog. Run track. No, he didn't come last. He came in second or third, I think. I don't have the official times or, or, or um, results in front of me, but – here, here he is in the look like could have been the 100 meters right here. See that? Look like he's in second or third place right there. But that's perfect. That's perfect for. Um, I mean, I mean, I mean, if you start off and just dust everybody, that's no. I don't think you can do that. But you know, that's a great start for his track career right there to come out and finish in the top two, three. Whatever, I'm sure that's not what he wanted to do, but he realizes also, man, I haven't run track to, since eighth, ninth grade for real. And it is a sport, it is a skill. It is not just get out there and run, dog. You know, it was the 60. He came in second to last. It's the 60. Okay, Coach Prime ran track and came in handy. Yeah, the results are up. I would have to look at the results, LTs. Let me see if I can find them right quick. But if he came into Look like he came in. It looked like he came, but you know how it is with these angles. It can look like he's coming in second place, but really, he 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 came in next to last by a millisecond. You know, all of these guys are fast. All of them with dust probably have 
99% of us on this chat. <laughs> yeah. So, Big LT, if you got those results, let me know, man. Let me know. I'll, I'll, I'll bring them up. Smash the like button. It's free. Show some love when you come inside. Definitely smash the like button for the algorithm so that it'll pop up on your page whenever I go live. You'll be able to see it. All right. So, um, we did talk about, well, I did miss this. Shout out to Dylan Edwards once again. Oh, check out rondillonrun.com. Rondillonrun.com. Get you some merch. Support Dylan Edwards. Rondillonrun.com. All right. And get you some if you haven't already. You understand me? Already. Here we go. <laughs>